How you? Good morning, everybody. How you doing? Your boy lost some weight. Look at that. It's gone. It'll be back. Um, just happened to, I just wanted to feel my face again. And I just wanted to feel my face again. That's really all it is. I, I look like an Eminem right now, so please forgive me. But this is a um, raw reaction to DSPs or you know, I like, he's Philip to me. He's starting to get less and less like DSP and being more and more like Philip. Because that's, that's just Philip. So, I'm watching Memology 101, and I just saw this craptacular. I don't even know what it is exactly. Let's go ahead and play and see. What did what did I just watch? Is that his actual No man, that's not his intro. Somebody no, that's not that's not an intro. Memology knows uh, how to you may have noticed there's an intro to the pre-stream podcast today. Did you? Did you notice? A lot of people didn't, I guess. That's serious. Hold on. Let's go back. Wait a minute. Hold up. Wait. Yeah. All right. Here we go. <laughs> Does did he realize somebody Hold on did he's serious Let's keep going Did you did you notice? A lot of people didn't Oh I noticed Philip because I started the pre-show and there's only like 140 people here now there's Oh I I didn't miss that I see some gray getting in there too Hold on time out why is that headline going really well? It's starting to really go way back up there, brother. You are not looking too well, bro. You're not looking too well. I'm teach you about being prompt and being, uh, uh, what's, what's the word? You uh, just said, you just said the word, Philip. It's the opposite of tardy. To be on time all the time. I can't remember the word for it, but you gotta be prompt? here. Prompt? You gotta be here for the beginning. You missed it. No, shut the fuck up. Excuse my oh, language. That's not. I that's remember. I'm watching memeology. Really, the success of this channel and the success of me as a content creator is due to you, because I don't have the know-how and the skill to make all this stuff. I just don't. Um, I don't have the means to pay a professional designer and pay them a bunch of money to put out graphics for my channel. I'm not big time like that where I can afford to pay someone tons of good money to make something good. He could use Canva. It's free. It's a free service, Philip. You can get it on iOS or Android. It's called Canva. They're very good at what they do. They're free. And if you spend a little bit of money, you get access to a lot of their pro features. And guess what? You can make your own intro. I've made my own intro and my outro using Canva. You got Fiverr, Philip. You got five dollars. Someone can make you a better intro than that hapless garbage I just saw. That e either two things: either someone made that to meme him, and he's just yeah, I think someone made that to meme him because he's not very sharp. If he would have, that had to be the p most piss poor intro I've ever seen in my life. It would have done better if they just would have put his picture up there and ran music. And then that's it. But they went so far as to put, I mean, it was a Japanese uh, game room on the inside. You know, they showed the inside of a Japanese game room. That's not, that's not a problem at all. But what does that got to do with DSP gaming? 
why did they go with that route? Why, did, why didn't they use his own footage and loop it somehow or slice it or cut it up and then put it in there? They went and... And he's proud of this. Remember, guys, he's proud of this. I mean, it, now this starting to make some sense. And why he has this weird, he had this weird smirk of, oh, there's some changes coming to the channel. That's not necessarily change. That's like putting wet toilet paper on the windows, hoping it can block out the sun. There's just certain things that just don't work, Philip. That intro is hot garbage truck juice. Thank the God that sent it, because if he's not a fan, he's trolling you, homie. He's trolling you. Very much in reality, it is you guys. He can't spend five dollars you know, to get an intro. Like I say, crowdfunding, right? That's what it's all about. <clears throat> give me those clicks, give me those views, give me money, money, money. Three hundred and forty-two. We have another new rep. Time out. Well, that's not unheard of. Either people are making sock accounts or genuinely people are. <laughs> it's a sock account. Look, we both know only crushed coconut juice is making these accounts. Now, there's some legit folks joining him because, as we all know, Misery Loves Company. Just as much people want to back a winner, there's some people want to back an underdog, and even worse, some people want to back the person that everybody else hates because they want to keep him around. I have a video that's going to go on that. It might 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 put me in some hot water with some folks, but the video is much necessary and much needed, or much needed, not much necessary, much needed, and I think very necessary. So, as I'm watching this, I'm not as I'm watching Philip actively talk about the fact that he has no idea how to create these things he has no technical know-how to keep up with the times that he doesn't have any i it's only because your submissions that keep me going which aka your money that keeps him going but he also doesn't have the he doesn't have the technical know-how he doesn't know how to do these fancy things you know, out of 13 years, I was just thinking about this right now, 13 years, and he comes across as if he's in his like late 70s or 80s, like he's never used a computer before, like he's never ever uh, downloaded an app, like he has no concept of what editing is. He really comes off like he is this, he's, he's just, he's geriatric. He doesn't, he's just, he's so dull to technology, which we both know it's somewhat true. Now, he is aware of technology. He knows how to use what's been given to him. But let's be honest, he's lazy. That's all. Because of learning these things, like going on Canva and going into uh, different apps that you can create short little intro five minutes you ain't got to pay for the premium subscription they may say you can only make up to five minutes you only need 20 minutes you may need 20 seconds that's all. you may need a minute at most if you want to do an intro of that for but he has no interest in doing any work that requires him to read you know that basic thing that we're taught in grade school he doesn't want to read. He doesn't want to apply that what he's read. You know your DIY. He doesn't want to do it yourself. He wants someone else to do it and pay him. Yeah, you heard me right. He doesn't pay people to do something. He wants people to pay him for them to do something. I couldn't even finish that statement because I, 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 I don't get it, man. I just don't get it. He's either an evil genius
um, the most morally bankrupt man I've ever seen online. Because he's a hypocrite as well as a liar, as well as a proven criminal committing fraud. No longer an opinion. That's facts. Man, what is going on with this guy? We are climbing today, guys. Only eight memberships to go. Eight to go. Now, ladies and gentlemen... Oh, not to mention, not to mention, my man is still using that, that, that juice box for music. Couldn't you ask one of your... Uh, no, because... No, see, it doesn't work. I was just... You know what? That, that answers that question already because... If he asked someone to make him that little intro that he could do, because, you know, he has a stream deck. Why aren't you using a stream? I would love to have a stream deck. But he's not even using the very things that he's been given because, again, it requires him to what? Read, understand, put it to put it to use, put it to work, and you he don't want to do that. Philip has only one goal, to give the less amount of power or energy to anything and get maximum results. Well, let me take slash results. Profits. Man, he could spend five dollars. Go to he can get he can go look. If Philip has five dollars, he could choose to go get a subway sandwich, eat that for the next, and that'll last him for like an hour. Or he can go to Fiverr, five forty something, some change, get him a, an actual sound edit that he could put in. He choose subway. Not because it's healthy, but just because it's food. That's all, just because it's food. He's sh so short-sighted. His long game doesn't exist. He is so desperate. I mean, I've never, I think I'm starting to see the desperation is so great. No, not all of you remember. Because I can see in the chat, your names are highlighted. <laughs> Come on. Eight to go. We could do this. We could hit the goal. I haven't today. eaten breakfast yet, man. Emo slot. We could have a marathon of fun in February. Feasting with the king. I want to feast. Look at this face. I want to feast. Come on. <laughs> let's <laughs> let's think about that for a second. Philip is expecting us to pay. For him to eat in front of us. You know, Philip could never do a charity screen for like, you know, food for children or feed the homeless. Because that dude would be eating all the profits. He'd be eating all the proceeds and the profits. My God. And people still do it. People still So not only does he get the money for the memberships, not only does he get people to pay him to watch him do a really Walmart value mukbang. I, I just I don't I don't even have words, man. This is it's the same shit. It's the same dumb ass, immature, fucking like no brain attitude. For every applies to everything. I've said it before and I'll say it again. Oh no. What you support will continue to thrive, which is why you should be very selective on this planet in your life about the things you support, <clears throat> all right? If you're okay... Uh, it writes itself. He is so... His, his lack of self-awareness is so great. Even a rock understands it's a rock. You know how I know? It knows when to get picked. It knows that when you pick it up and you throw it, it knows best what to do. It either sits there or hurls to the end. It doesn't, it doesn't throw insults. It doesn't try to apologize. It knows what it is. It's just a rock. If someone picks it up and puts it uh, on top of some paper, it's now what? It's, it's, it's now keeping paper down if it gets windy. If it gets hurled through the air, if it's if from a slingshot to someone throwing it, it's at the mercy of what? Whatever it hits. But it's not its fault. It's self-aware. How is the rock? And we all know rock's not self-aware. However, he is so dull to his own plight. He doesn't even see that people are supporting him 
to do less. Actually, I think he is aware of that part. I just think that he still thinks he's giving them a service. So it's not in the extreme degree as we're thinking, you know, because we use our brains and we have a moral compass, you know. So I, I sometimes I get lost for words watching Philip for the first time. This, again, these are these first reactions. And I don't have words for this guy. People have been supporting him. Trolls, as well as his supporters, have been ensuring that he stays online, stays abusing people, stays uh, running away from his own responsibility as an adult, and continually committing criminal fraud by allegedly calling it crowdfunding, when in the reality, he's just using YouTube as a welfare system. I said it before, I'll say it again. He is using YouTube and his supporters as a welfare system because his ass don't want to go back to work because we both know, and he's very aware of this, he cannot work a nine to five. He just can't. He has never developed those skills that we started to learn when we started to work our first job. He doesn't have the social skills that, that, that needs to be have developed to be amongst the public. And he definitely doesn't have the talents that, you know, everybody finds their talents somewhere in life in doing something. He doesn't have any of those. His hobby is his job because he actually doesn't have a hobby. He doesn't watch movies. He doesn't watch, well, he watches movies, but they're all, you know, that's, they go in, they, they go in the eyes and out the ears and that's it. Last time he knows about it. He doesn't read. He doesn't keep up with current events. He definitely don't want into sports. He is, he is a void of social interaction. He, I cannot even imagine he's boring to himself. Well, not really. He's probably entertained because he doesn't have to do anything. Because reading require, requires what? Interest and energy. And Philip just doesn't have that. I, this, is where I, this is where I pity him. He's pitiful. And uh, I'm going to cut the video there. I think I've... I need to figure out how to eat breakfast after watching this junk. So... If you like the reaction, you like the videos, if you like the channel, guys, 30-day risk-free subscribe to the channel for sin the sinner's commentary and, of course, controlling the narrative and other uh, uh, Christian-related perspectives, which is what? All about the Lord and, more importantly, about how sin affects every single soul and how they're at. These kind of character studies gives an insight into why believers think the way we do how we look at the world how we interact with the world and how we're supposed to treat each other philip could definitely use an ass whooping but he definitely could he most definitely use some repentance and get you know i probably need some x lax too because brother man he looks looks a little congested too Ugh. so anyway love you very much if you like the video you want to see more content like this don't forget to give me a 30-day risk-free sub and like and comment in the comment section below. I love my comment section. I don't have to police my comment section because we, we're a unique community. If you join this community, we're very unique. We have believers and non-believers that are coexisting with one goal, all of us enjoying our humanity with each other and making comments and, and conversating with each other. It's a beautiful thing. I have a community like no one else's online, and I'm proud of that. So I'll see you guys soon. I'm praying for you. In Jesus' name, I'm praying for you. And don't forget, if you do become a channel member, buckle up.